हेलो बच्चो सो लेट सी द्वेश्चन एंड ई एम एफ ऑफ फिफ्टीन वोल्ट इज अप्लाइड इन सर्किट ऑयल कंटेनिंग ऑफ फाइव कैनरी इंडक्टेंस एंड टेन ओम रेजिस्टेंस द रेशियो ऑफ द करेंट एट टी इक्व टू इनफाइनेट एंड एन टी इक्व टू वन इज द फर्स्ट ऑप्शन इज ई रेस टू पावर वन बाई टू अपॉन ई रेस टू पावर वन बाई टू माइनस वन सेकेंड ऑप्शन इज ई स्क्वायर अपॉन ई स्क्वायर माइनस वन एंड योर थर्ड ऑप्शन इज वन माइनस ई रेस टू पावर माइनस वन एंड योर फोर्थ ऑप्शन इज ई रेस टू पावर माइनस वन so basically here you have an emf of 15 volt and it is applied in a circuit coil containing of 5 henry inductance and 10 ohm resistance now you have to calculate the ratio of the current at t equals to uh, infinite and t equals to 1 so we know that i is equals to i not 1 minus e is equal minus rt by l right where l by r is time constant tau remember this time constant Fine. So uh, at t is equal to infinite, case first. At t is equal to infinite, you will get the value of current as i is equal to i not one minus e is equal minus infinite. You get the value of i equal to i not one minus one by infinite. Solving it further, you get a value of i is equal to. Let's solve it over here. You get a value of i is equal to i not one minus zero, which means i is equal to i not is. The value in your first case. Now, in case number second, you got the value of t as one. So, i is equal to i not one minus e raised to minus r by l. Got it? Now, what is the value of r? The value of r is ten. The value of l is five. So, i is equal to i not one minus e raised to the power. The value of r is ten, and the value of l is five. i is equal to i not. One minus e raised to one minus two. So i is equals to i not e square minus one upon e. In second case, you will get a current of i not e square minus one upon e square. Okay, and you have to calculate the ratio of the current at t equals to infinite and at t equals to one. So you have to calculate the ratio of i one upon i. So let's solve this on the next page. So i one upon i two goes out be. I not upon I not e square minus one upon e square. I not so I not cancel हो जाएगा ये upon का upon ऊपर चला जाता है. It comes out be e square upon e square minus one. So your B option is absolutely correct. E square upon e square minus one is the right answer. So I hope you got the concept of this question now. All the very best.